We're here today at Brookfield Zoo's Animal Hospital where we've got some of our Mexican gray wolf puppies over for their first exams. These guys are about six weeks old right now, so this is their first visit to the hospital and we're gonna be doing just a general checkup on these guys. And we're basically doing the same thing that you would have done to your uh, pet dog if you got a new dog and we're taking them to the vet as a puppy. So uh, our veterinary team is checking the animals out from head to toe, looking at everything from teeth and eyes to listening to their heart and lung sounds. Uh, they're gonna get a blood draw so that we can check a full uh, health panel from a blood standpoint. And we'll get a dose of a dewormer into them for any intestinal puppy parasites they may have. They'll get their first round of puppy vaccines today. And uh, we'll just really make sure they're in fantastic health. Um, these Mexican gray wolves are a really special species here at Brookfield Zoo. These animals uh, were extinct in the wild as recently as the 1970s. And, through a partnership program with the United States Fish and Wildlife Service. Uh, we've actually been working with biologists in the field to restore this population um, into the southwestern United States and uh, help make sure these guys are gonna be around for future generations to come. One really unique and interesting thing about this is we've got three of these puppies here at the zoo, but they were actually part of a litter of five puppies. And uh, two of those puppies were actually at a very young age taken back into the wild and placed into a den site with a uh, mother in the wild that had her own litter of pups and this is called cross fostering and basically we just reintroduced uh, those two puppies back into a natural free-ranging setting with a wild mother that'll teach them natural skills and uh, make sure that they grow up into uh, healthy adults in the wild and then all of our animals here at the uh, Brookfield Zoo are managed in a way that they are also uh, potential release candidates in the future. We've had adult wolves that have actually been uh, released back out into the wild so it's a really great conservation story. We're really happy to be able to work with Fish and Wildlife Service on this project. We'll get these guys finished up here this morning and uh, get these back with their mom as soon as possible. So the next time you're out here at Brookfield Zoo, be sure to stop by Regenstein's Wolf Woods to see these uh, wonderful pups out on exhibit with their mom and the rest of the pack.